before Charlie and I launched createyourownlegendnow.com, I, I had a very hard time understanding how I would be using video, let alone how any other professional might be using video. I mean, if you're a doctor, a lawyer, an accountant, you know, you've got that professional mantle, and what are you going to do with video? After all the video that we've done now and all the creation of, of uh, various video products, I, I can't think of anyone who can't use video. That's my struggle now is show me someone in some profession that cannot communicate a powerful message through video and I think it'll take us all of about four or five minutes to create a whole you know, video scenario that would work for that profession. It's interesting for me to remember back that I started on the stage at six and not everybody has my background but when I was in theater in college and the other people who would be performing in the shows either that I was directing or that I was in and they were pre-med pre-law they were accounting students they were engineers yes even left brain engineers all kinds of people who were there participating learning what it was to communicate and show who they are when I first went out for some jobs and I would interview with people, would always say at the bottom, some of my theatrical events. Because I started a musical theater group at Tufts University. When I got my MBA at the Wharton School, I did theater. I've done theater while I've had my own career. Everybody would stop me and want to talk about theater. What they had done, how they had used this skill. These are life skills that we are learning. How to get up, how to talk, how to present ideas, how to communicate with people. So video can be used by all these people. I'd be interested to find out now what some of those pre-law, pre-med, all these other people that years ago were using it, have they remembered how important this is to show their personality? There's not a corporate way to do something. You really need to show who you are. Video is the way to do that, and learning how to use it can be a lot of fun.